Hey, what's going on, guys? Let's do this problem right here. This question is asking an 800 watts iron is left on the iron board with its space exposed to the air at 20 degrees Celsius. The convection heat transfer coefficient between the base surface and the surrounding air is 35 watts per meter square Kelvin. If the base has emissivity of 0.6 and the surface area of 0.02 meter square, determine the temperature of base of the iron. And let's see how we can find it. So this is related to convection and radiation and they have given the total heat transfer rate that's given by. So let's list uh, all the given information. So first we have heat transfer rate that's this is total right total is equal to 800 watts and then we have air at 20 degrees celsius so we we are dealing with surface temperature and surrounding temperature so this is surrounding temperature right so this one is surrounding temperature determine the temperature of base of the surface temperature is the question okay so T surrounding is given by 20 degrees Celsius we have to convert into Kelvin because when we use radiation equation we have to convert degrees Celsius into Kelvin we just have to add 273 to this one that's going to give us 293 Kelvin right and let's look at other informations. We have convection heat transfer coefficient that is H value, right? So H value is given by 35 watts per meter square Kelvin. And emissivity is given by 0.6 and then surface area is 0 0.02 meter square and let's see how we can find the su surface temperature so let's go ahead and create the equation so q total q dot total is going to be equal to q dot radiation plus q dot convection right so we know that for radiation the equation is going to be emissivity times area surface area times emissivity times surface area times sigma that's stephen Boltzmann constant times t power 4 that's going to be surface temperature minus surrounding temperature t surrounding power 4 and this is what we are going to have for radiation plus convection is going to be HAS HAS delta T so this is going to be T surface T surface minus T surrounding right so this is going to be the equation for convection now let's go ahead and find this one separately and then plug it in the main equation right so let's find the Q radiation first. Q dot radiation is equal to emissivity times surface area times Stephen Boltzmann constant times surface area surface temperature power four times minus surrounding temperature power four. Okay, emissivity is given by zero point six. And then we have surface area provided by 0 0.02. And then Stephen Boltzmann constant is going to be 5.67 times 10 to the power of minus 8. And surrounding surface temperature, that's what we are trying to find. And surrounding temperature is, is given right here. That's 293 power 4. All right. These are the information we have. Now let's go ahead and create the equation for convection. Q convection is equal to H A S T surface minus T surrounding. And here H is this value. That is uh, 
heat trans the heat transfer coefficient that is provided right here that's 35 times the surface area that is 0 0.02 and temperature surf surface temperature that's what we are trying to find minus surrounding temperature that's 293 now this addition if we add them together that's going to be equal to 800 watts that's our, that's what given in the beginning now let's go ahead and equate this one so this is going to be equal to 800 that's is equal to these two addition of these two you know so before maybe before we go further let's simplify this one furthermore if you simplify this q radiation that comes out to be 0 0.0 Zero six. Hmm. So this uh, comes out to be zero point zero six eight. Maybe I can do it together instead of writing separately. So let's uh, go ahead and plug right here. So eight hundred is equal to Q radiation Q dot radiation plus Q dot convection right convection and then we equate this into q radiation that we figure out right here let's multiply everything and see what we get and uh, if you multiply these things together that's going to give you 0 0.06804 times 10 to the power minus 8 t power 4 minus 5.0145 so this is q radiation plus q convection that's going to be 0 0.70 minus 205.1 right and let's go ahead and simplify this one furthermore so here we are going to have 0 0.06804 times 10 to the power of minus 8 t power 4 plus 0 0.7 t is equal to 1010.11 watts so this is what we get finally by doing trial and error method trial and error we get t is equal to 874 Kelvin that is equal to 601 degrees Celsius and that's how we do this kind of problems I hope you guys find this video helpful see you next time